Well, well, I'll tell you something I do know in Hamilton alone here. And what I do know is this. What did Doug, what did he do with Sundown, the Urban Core, Sun Rusty Center? This happened in Detroit, 19, back in the 60s. Flashpoint, that was Flashpoint of Detroit riots. That did million of dollars, this was very crippled the city of Detroit at the time. Anyways, what can happen in Hamilton, I, this is what can happen there. The homeless people will be sleeping at the urban core under the canvies and place be shut down. The contractor gonna come in there in the morning and they're gonna find them sleeping there. What do you think a contractor gonna do? What do you think the developer gonna do? Well, the developer will turn around and have to leave. They, the the old guy to tell the developer, this is our turf, get lost. That's what they're gonna say to him. And they persist on not responding. And the guy can add a gnat, and he's waking us up at one uh, in the middle. You know what the police we call? Oh, but the police won't we? But uh, then we'll have a contract will leave. He, he won't call the police because he want to get a condo built. He can turn around, hire a goon for hire, or the police can turn around and say, well, we don't get involved because that's, because you know, we don't, well, we know, like, they, he'll hire a goon for hire. Police will come to break them up. They turn around, and guess what? Boom, boom. Punch, start beating the cops. Start beating other people. Start punching the valve, or punching them in the face, or beating cops, and beating security guards. And next thing you know, the next thing you know, car is getting tossed and burnt. And before you know, got a full-scale riot on their hands. While the full, when that full-scale riot happened, guess what? What do you think gonna happen, a full-scale riot? Well, there'd be burning buildings throughout the city, burning this, burning that, the building would be burning and that. The city be forced to call Canadian Armed Forces, or the city would be running call with an additional riot cop, while Doug Ford sit back in house and say, well, let the city die and let the city riot themselves to death. Hmm, that's Doug Ford. And Doug Ford get any money extra riot cop. Oh, we can't afford it because we don't have the funding to do it. And Doug Ford, so Doug, they'd be screaming at him, we need this money, but no, Doug Ford won't give money. Then they'd be forced to call the army and the Canadian Armed Forces. Hmm. What do you think gonna happen when we call the army in? Well, two things, number one, they come in with four guns are blazing. They will literally will go in and they start cleaning all up. And they're gonna do is process the homeless people through the armory, and the raiding paddy wagons outside the door will be loaded on a paddy. All rioters will be processed, and some of them could be some will be sorry for terrorism acts. What does that mean? Some of them will be sorry for terrorism. Imagine what that means. Some will be find guilty of sorrows of many so. Many be charged with rioting, being being involved in a riot, and top of that, the investigation drags on there long enough. Who do you think gonna happen? What do you think gonna happen? Do you want to really know? They're gonna drag, and gonna find that Doug Ford to blame cuts. Doug Ford caused the issue. Doug Ford get blamed heavy. Doug for a cuff snapped on and put in jail. Well, and all that. And meanwhile, the city struck with millions of dollars in damage that had to clean up. And on top of that, a lot of homeless people will be so, well, then things, then I point to say, we, like, we got to do something about it. And it will be forever trying to cover. So, honestly, You know, that is what's gonna happen there. So you have to watch out and think. You know, it can, what I see coming in September in Hamilton, with all this closure, I see a riot in downtown Hamilton. I mean, real riot. It's gonna be worse, it's gonna make a Detroit riot look like a walk in a park, in a city park, that's what it look like. 
Anyway, so I see it coming, and it all be caused by Mr. Ford. He be joked, Dougie Ford will get, will have to put the bill clean it, which he won't do. Anyway, blog anyway, over.